Hi, this is Channing Humphrey with Semi Pro Live. We're here live from beautiful West Fort Worth, Texas. We're getting ready to get geared up for the national championship tournament. So I'm gonna I got the pleasure of having our first BYF athlete of the evening. I've got Robert Edmonds Jr. Uh, we're gonna catch up to this young man, just see how the season's been going since we last got I think last time we guys got to talk to you guys was in uh Temple, Texas, down at the Battle of the Best tournament at the Super Super regional, so we haven't really gotten a chance to catch up to you guys. So, what's been going on since? Uh, we just been playing hard, just trying to still try to win that first one. You know, we still working hard, just having fun at the same time with a good organization, just doing our thing. All right, man. So, tell me a little bit more since you're the first one. You're kind of the the example for. Uh, the next couple of interviews. So, how have, how have you enjoyed your time being a part of this organization? Uh, I loved it. Um, great coaches, great teammates. Um, it's just fun, having fun at all time, and just yeah. Okay, okay. So, what school do you currently attend, and what's your projected graduation date? Uh, go to Shadow Creek High School, um, class of 2023. Okay. So, man, uh, do you have any offers or any uh, recruiting on the horizon? Uh, not yet. I'm still working on it. Okay. Well, hey, hopefully this will go away towards that. Now, uh, speaking of recruiting, man, are you involved in any – what do you do off the field? Are you involved in any out, off the field activities? Uh, I play baseball and just work out most of the time, yeah. What position do you play in baseball? Uh, third base. Third base. Third base, man. So – what are some of the skills that uh, you take from baseball that you try to cross over to football? Uh, I take footwork, um, awareness, and just speed. Okay, okay, speed, sir. Now, well, hey, and we're coincidence do have a story about speed. Hey, my grandfather, Lou Johnson, he, uh, used to play for the Dodgers way back in the day, and in the 1965 World Series, that's the same World Series as Sandy Koufax threw the perfect game. My grandpa got hit by a pitch in game five, stole all the bases. That was the only run in that game. And in game seven, both pitchers were throwing a perfect game in that game, and he hit the game-winning home run, the only run in the game. So shout out to Lou Johnson. But uh, before I let you go, man, uh, is there any organizations, any clubs, uh, or do you want to give a shout out to any people before I let you go? Uh, I want to give a shout out to my coaches, my teammates, my mom and my dad, um, uh, my school. And yeah, that's it. Put some names on the mom and dad. They work hard. Uh, Latoya Williams and Robert Edmondson. All right, man. Well, hey, man, this is a very well-spoken young man. Appreciate you taking time out of your busy evening to sit down with me. We'll see you guys next time on Semi-Pro Live. Yeah.